Hello, it is me again. These last two weeks, I have been ill and so is my sister. We got off the airplane from vacation, which I didn't film the second week. I didn't film a lot of videos I need to catch up and I missed a lot of shoutouts. That's for another time. Anyways, we got home on July 15th and then July 16th, we started feeling ill and so as I was ill, I watched a lot of YouTube. And um, one of the videos I watched was actually by Jenna Marbles and it was testing my dog's intelligence and I thought, whoa, good idea. I actually have no idea where my dog, Scamp, will be on the intelligence meter. Sometimes I'll think he's like a genius and then he'll like try to eat his own foot, so... So yeah, that's what I'm doing. So on here I have how to test a dog's intelligence with the instructions necessary to test a dog's intelligence. Here we have a ceramic pig that my sister felt necessary to buy for like, what, $30? For $30. Um, she broke it. I stepped on the arm by accident. We're gonna need to stopwatch before we start this, so... I didn't think this through. Google has a stopwatch, don't they? Yep. So the first test we need to do will involve a towel. And what we need to do is we need to pretty much throw a towel over his head and see how long he will have it on before he's able to um, free himself from it. Can we do a blanket? We can do a blanket. Okay, we're gonna start in three, two, one. I think it's too big for him. Just to clarify that we're not cheating the system, it actually says on the Wikia page um, that use a small blanket or a towel. So that, I guess, wasn't necessarily a small blanket. Three, two, one, go. It's off. How long is that? Five seconds. I don't think that was fully on him, but no, we'll, we'll give it to him. So what's that, three points? Three points for Scamp. So the second test we're going to be putting Scamp through is we pretty much have to hide a treat under uh, a towel. Um, yeah, so we have to show him the treat and while he's watching, uh, put the treat on the floor and put the towel over it and see how long it takes for him to get do you, to the so treat. So these treats are small, so do you have three? Well, no, you've given him like, given him like a hundred tonight. Just one. Uh, I don't even know how many of those you can actually eat, so we should probably slow down. Three, two, one. Take it! Did you get it? Let's see if you get it. He got the treat. That was 35 seconds. So um, that is... Two points. So he's at five points now. Five points. I believe this is the last test we will be putting him through. So we have to set up a low opening just by using a board and a few books. It needs to be large enough so that he can reach it with his paws but he can't like grab it with his mouth. So put the treat under that area uh, while he's watching and push it far enough underneath uh, so that he can't reach it with his muzzle and see how long it takes him to get it. Okay. Scamp? Okay, now we're gonna just try and put it under, under the couch. Let's see what it does. In three, two, one, take it. See how he's going about this. Did he just stick his head under? Yeah. Did he get it? <laughs> he's not even trying to use it. He already got it, Jade. You got it? Oh, I used his face. Yeah. Scamp! Okay. Well, let's see how much using his face is worth. None of them say, um, succeeds but using his muzzle. Uh, looks like it'd be between a 1 and a 2 point. Yeah. 1.5. 1.5. Okay, so it's at 6.5. Okay. So the final one is you put a tree under one of the cups and you, you lift it up and down and show the dog eight to 10 times. 
And then this is a test their memory. You put all the cups out and then tell them to take the treat and then you try and get the treat. They check the right cup on the first try, it's two points. If they find it within two minutes, it's one point. And if they don't find it, it's zero points. So we're gonna set that up right now. So we have our four cups. Treat is under, oh, treat is under this cup. I've shoved him 10 times. And now we have to lead him out of the room and see which one he goes for. So lead him out of the room, do tricks with him for 30 seconds, and then we'll bring him back in. Okay. So. Okay, bring him out of the room. Skip. Hey, put it there you go, buddy. Skip! Take it! Okay, he has the right cup. Sure. Right cup, is that his first <laughs> scale? Yeah, it's his first try, technically. It's his first, first try. <laughs> he's, not, he's not making a lot of progress. Did you set the timer on? No, there didn't need to be a timer. Just need to be how long, uh, which one you went for first. This is not working out for you, is it, Scamp? Did you finally flip it? Thanks, Scamp. There you oh go. Oh boy. That's the end of the intelligence test. Intelligence test. He got 8.5 points, and there's a rating on it. So 8 to 10 points was obedient school honor student. Scamp, you're an honor student. I did like a hat on him. I did like a like a graduation cap. Yeah. Okay. Hello. So I am still really not feeling tip top. So thanks for watching the video. Yep. Now I forgot to do shoutouts many weeks and many a week and it didn't happen. Oops. So I'm just going to put all the shoutouts that I missed on here and um, In do. three, two, one. So yes, I'm not feeling great. So I'm just gonna leave it at that. Um, I think even one of the weeks I forgot to include the theme in the video at all, but somehow someone still guessed it. I'm guessing they were going off of other people's videos, or they just found out the theme because the theme was revealed the last week and then it happened. Anyways, the theme the last week I uploaded was coffee. So yeah, I'm gonna be done now. Sorry Bye. about this. Goodbye. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Yep.